We are like a team and uh, I told you the we spoke about that a little. I spoke with the player before the, the training session, the first one we had after the the attack. We had this minute of silence and uh, I felt that uh, all the players were really concerned about that and uh, but I didn't feel that uh, it affected the way we wanted to train and to play. Then, uh, as I told you, it's not because we don't care about that. It's just because we have to do something else and to entertain people. We have to to do as the best we can for the club. And uh, so we, we we just focus on that now. Uh, Remy, just talk just a bit more about what you've been up to during the international break. Because you mentioned uh, to Pete a moment ago you had six players away, so it must have been quite difficult to, to work, bearing in mind that you had those players away. But what exactly have you been up to over the international break? A lot of things. <laughs> uh, seven players were missing, but uh, I was really, really pleased to have uh, back uh, players like uh, Jaurès, like Thiago, like... Uh, uh, you know, some player that I didn't know very well, to be fair. I mean, on training session, you have in football, you have games, so you can see players playing, but you have also training session and the way they live in the football club all the day. So I had a lot of interesting information more on that week. And we had uh, quite a good session, you know, so I learned a lot again. Do you think the players are training well and are starting to see what, what it is you're trying to get them to do? They are very aware that uh, things are different. Uh, this is my job to, to make them believe that uh, where we try to go is uh, another way that they used to, to have. Of course, the first they have uh, was not uh, efficient. so. They, they had the feeling that uh, they needed to change, so I'm going, I'm giving them a direction to work and we carry on in that direction and I feel that uh, I have some good uh, answer with that.